when does a lie become a political pitch? Right? When does when what's the difference between politics and straight out lying? Or how do you how can you tell if a politician is lying or not? Are they just saying stuff to to appease the crowd? Are they just playing to the audience? Well, Ted Cruz has said, and I kid you not, I'm going to play the recording of it, saying that U.S. Senator Ted Cruz irked, says that space pirates are, are a threat to humanity. Space pirates. That's what he said. Right? I'm not making it up, right? This is right up there with uh, Trump's, uh, you know, the sound of wind turbines gives you cancer and, and the lights go, you can't watch TV if the wind isn't blowing with wind, wind power. It's just fucking stupid, right? The stupidity, I mean, it's just, is it just me? Is it just, is it just Conti saying, oh, these people are so fucking stupid and I'm so smart? I, I don't think so. I just think that there has to be some sort of, some sort of sanity in, in our politics. So Senator Ted Cruz has been ridiculed for arguing that the U.S. military needs a Space Force branch to defend against pirates. Fucking Martians. Pirates. Uh, uh, sick. Uh, pirates. Or is it, right? Is the Earth really flat? Is, um, is it really a donut shape, right? And, uh, you know, and uh, it, it's because it, water doesn't bend and it's it, nothing. It, we couldn't possibly be on a on a round planet spinning a thousand miles an hour, a liquid planet. Right? Is it all a lie? It's fucking. Are we in danger of being being hit by 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 space pirates? <sighs> pirates threaten. Quote. Pi- listen. Just listen to him in his own words. I can't believe I'm, I'm even reading this shit. Oh, here he is. Let's listen. Since the ancient Greeks first put to sea, nations have recognized the necessity of naval forces and maintaining a superior capability to protect waterborne travel and commerce from bad actors. Pirates threaten the open seas, and the same is possible in space. There he is. In this, and the same is possible in threaten the open seas. Pirates threaten the open seas, and the same is possible in space. Pirates threaten the open seas, and the same is possible in space. Space pirates. In this same way, I believe we too must now recognize the necessity of a space force to defend the nation and to protect space commerce (laughs) and civil space exploration. Right, so he hasn't. He has, and people are having fun with it. He never. He hasn't really said that from alien life. He could be. He could be insinuating. He could spin that and say, "Well, space pirates from China, or space pirates from Russia." Right? They could spin it that way too. But the the in, the indication there is that the pirates are are exa- are exactly that. So people are having a good time with it. Dead Cruz. Uh, maybe a joke, but space pirates are not. The threat is real. <laughs> Look at these guys. Uh, space pirates. This fucking shit is crazy. Huh? What else? Um, I didn't watch that one. This is a great logo right there. Right? Uh, space pirates. I think I lost it, but that 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 logo that this yeah, right? Fuck it. <laughs> What do they look like, right? Are they, um, oh, so anyway, man, it's so ridiculous, right? Is it any more ridiculous than Trump saying this? Hillary wanted to put up wind, wind. If you, if you have a windmill anywhere near your house, congratulations. Your house just went down 75% in value. And they say the noise causes cancer. You tell me that one, okay? You know, the thing makes it so, and of course, it's like a graveyard for birds. All right. Is it any more ridiculous than when he said this right here? Mills. You'd be doing wind, windmills. And if it doesn't, if it doesn't blow, you can forget about television for that night. Darling, I want to watch television. I'm sorry the wind isn't blowing. I know a lot about wind. 
So, I mean, is he making it up? Is it just a joke? Is it just a stage pitch? I don't, I don't know, man. It's just, it's, it's scary to think that, that Ted Cruz, a senator, a sitting United States senator, and the president of the United States, believe these ridiculous ideas. Now, is it just a pitch? Is Cruz just saying space pirates so that they can get that money to, to create a space force, get more money, more billions of dollars for NASA to go to the moon and then launch off the moon and go to Mars, right? Rather do that than feed the, feed the people on the planet, right? 40, 400,000 fucking, 40, 4, 40 million people in the country living in abject poverty. Uh, is that it's more important to 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 go to Mars than help the people on Earth, right? That's essentially what he's saying. And you got to watch out for the pirates, right? Because there's pirates up in the fucking sky, right, roaming around, ready to ready to take your shit. Right? Or, or, or Trump, is, do we believe him? Or do the wind turbines? Are we stupid enough to believe that the sound of wind turbines gives you cancer? Right, or doesn't he? Does he not know that that wind wind power is stored? Right, that the wind doesn't have to be blowing for the power to be re- released. I mean, is it is it all just is it just is it just politics? Is what I'm trying to say. Is it all is it okay to make up these stupid stories and cater to the dumbest people in the country or or people that are just don't have time to pay attention? Not dumb. I take that back. People are not dumb. People are just are are um, uh, busy and they put their fate faith in you know the politicians right they put their faith in the politicians right they you know they're gonna they're gonna drain the swamp they're gonna they're gonna make your life better um, they're gonna make your life easier you're gonna make more money you're gonna you're gonna live better right that's that is really the function of a, of a politician is to represent you in government so that you can get more of what you need to live, right? But instead, it, it, it just works out where, where uh, who's going to get that money for NASA? Who's going to get all that money? But that, I, I'll just cut this short. That's, that's all I wanted to say about it. We have a senator who believes that, that there are pirates floating around in space, ready to take your stuff, ready to shut you down, and a president who believes that the sound of wind gives you cancer. Marcus Conti reporting.